So hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this pre assessment skill badge so first of all if you're new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel now here you have to come over here and click on start challenge now if you're new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel now follow as i'm doing so that you get full score in this lab without any issue now first thing is that you have to just click on the start lab and then just open the console in cognito window so just wait for the console to get logged in and then we have to just activate the cloud shell and many of you are facing some kind of issue do not worry everything will be covered in this video just click on i understand click on i agree and agree and continue and then you have to just activate the cloud shell click on it and then just click on continue and authorize yourself now in the description box of this video i've shared one repository we'll be using that only do not worry about it now here first thing is that we have to initiate two cloud shell session and just click on this plus icon to initiate one more first of all let me increase the font size and then you have to just click on plus icon to initiate one more session now here we have to export the zone i will find the zone first of all come to here and here just copy the export zone and just use any notepad or anything else now just find the zone if you are unable to find use control f and then just type zone like this let me show you how you have to do here you can just come over here and from here just paste the zone over here like this and select all and just paste on your cloud shell just paste over here then click on second shell paste it like this now from the first shell come over here and then run the number two command over here and wait for it to get created now in the second shell we have to initiate the SSH session so just run it and if you get any kind of error just return again now you have to wait for the cluster to get created for the task number one then only you will be able to initiate all the next step okay then only you will be able to initiate the next step from here just type alloy db and just click on the product section just wait for some time now here you can see the cluster is created and ready but the instance is not ready so we need to wait for the instance to get ready so that we can initiate the next steps of this lab so do not worry it will take 5 to 10 minutes sometimes even more so you need to wait for it and then we'll move forward to the next step of this lab so just wait for some time and you can just minimize the here you can see when you click on it connectivity section the private ip address will be shown over here but it is not being shown that means you need to wait for some more time so just come over here to the back section and then just you have to wait so here just click on lap instance and wait for it to get created and then we'll move forward to the next step okay you can just bring back the cloud shell to its normal mode
come over here and from here you can click on view connectivity and here you can see private IP is visible so you have to just export the IP now here what kind of mistake many of you may make I will show you when you will click on export alloy DB okay and just export the private IP you'll just paste the entire content and hit enter and then you'll try to just run the store storing of private IP command and then you'll just run the initiation of SQL client then PSQL client then you'll get this kind of error because what you make a one mistake first thing the cluster is still in creation state basically the backup and once it's done you can see but you made mistake I am going to tell you here you can see you have added the 5432 port also so we don't have to add this you have to just export the IP address only basically the external IP sorry private IP address come over here connectivity configuration and just paste it like this copy it carefully and just after equal to paste it now here again if you try to run it you will get the error so just remove it remove the full stop copy entire content paste over here and then after that you have to just run this echo command after that just run this one and here it will ask for password so basically password is invisible you have to just carefully copy this change through me and paste over here it won't be visible just paste it and hit enter now if you see this you are locked in now here you have to run each query one by one just run from the github repo like this and if you're new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel so just keep running one by one So you see this kind of after uh, just once you have learned all the query come to the lab instruction and check the score and if you are unable to see the score just refresh the browser window or just check the task just visit that task and check the score and after that i will show you how you can claim the patch do not worry just reload the browser and check it just end the lab and click on the course once you click on it you will be able to see you have completed the batch do like the video and subscribe the channel